I'm Linda Bridge and I'm the executive director of the Info Food Shelf. I've been doing this job for about nine years. The money that people donate to us, 74% of every dollar that comes to us is spent entirely on the purchase of food. That is it. Since there's only one paid employee here, our expenses for that are very, very low. And then the operation costs at 16% of the dollar. So we're real proud of that too. So that averaging over 400 families every single week coming in here to get food. And that means you're talking anywhere between 15 to 25,000 pounds of food going out of here every week and having to get it to buy it to bring it back in. So it gets really, really tough. I just brought this out just to show you a little bit about, too. This is an indicator of where the families are from. Everybody thinks that they're always from the Thompsonville area, but it's not true. This is the entire surrounding area that we have our families that are located in all of these different areas. The housing market, the foreclosures, everything, it's all playing an impact, and it's, you know, in all of the different areas in the town of Enfield, which I know, you know, we're both familiar with our little town here. We had to get designated Enfield as a town that was in dire need of a summer lunch program. So our president of our board, Roger LeBlanc, decided to um, partner up with some other companies and like St. Patrick's Church is where the lunch bunch is held so during the summer kids actually now they have a place to go down and they get a free lunch the parents go down they get to sit around and and relax <laughs> last summer it was they got to sit in the air conditioning but they, then we have companies that come in and put on games and shows and projects and everything for the kids in the summertime.